Those young people here who are not married, and yet you're getting toward that age, I always want to give a little bit of instruction in that. If my son wanted to go and, at, when he's 16, wanted to go and be alone with a girl somewhere, I would prohibit it. And if someone said to me and asked me, what's the matter, don't you trust your son? I would say, well, no, I don't trust my son. Well, why don't you trust your son? Because I don't trust his dad. Now, listen to me. There's a reason why my son is with me. If my son wasn't with me, one of the staff members from Heart Cry, I never go anywhere alone. I always have a testimony, a witness. I never, I'm never anywhere alone. I don't, I don't trust circumstances. I don't trust the devil. I don't trust me. Put walls up everywhere. I protect myself with wisdom. But the beginning of that wisdom is that I know how frail all men are. Young people, sometimes you're too bold. You think you've got a lot more control than you actually do. I believe that young people should get to know each other in the church. I believe there should be interrelationships and fun and all kinds of things. But when you get to the point of taking someone seriously, romantically, as a possibility of a wife or something or a husband, I want you to learn to proceed with a great deal of caution. A great deal of caution. Young men also realize this. It doesn't matter if you tell a girl 14 times a day, we're just friends. She's not going to believe you if you're calling her all the time. Be careful how you deal with hearts. Men, young men, be very careful. First of all, if you desire a young lady because you would like to spend time with her, uh, ask yourself, what is the commitment you're willing to make to her? Are you just wanting to use her to have feminine companionship or friendship without giving any commitment? Young men, do you have really have any business thinking about a relationship with a girl if you're still a boy? Um, if dad's still paying the insurance of your car, you're a boy. M boys don't play with girls. Men. Men have relationships with girls, not boys. You see, guys, listen to me. This is very important. You should desire uh, companionship. But companionship of a female requires that you be a man first. Okay? That means you're going to have to leave aside childish things. You young boys, even in your early teens, you need to be thinking about becoming men. Have you ever watched the movie Master and Commander about the, the British fighting the French privateers? And when the two boats lock up, the two ships lock up in battle on the ancient seas there between England and France, the man who leads the Marines into the other boat and makes the charge is about 16 years old. The boy that's handling the helm on the boat is about 13 and he's already had his arm blown off in battle. What's the point? The point is, they were men. You live in a culture that wants to keep you as boys until you're 35. 